Hello, my name is Christopher Martinez uh, from Northwest Vista, and um, I'm in the, I'm the guest speaker going to talk um, about a painting I like that I think was cool when I learned about art history in um, high school. Um, it's by an artist by uh, the name of Peter Paul Rubens. This was made during the years of 1637 to 38. Um, the medium or material that it's on is um, oil and canvas. It had to be painting, I, I'm aware of that. Um, it's a pretty big painting. Um, it's actually 81 inches by 136 inches. Back. Actually, it's not that big. And it's currently uh, resided in Florence. Um, but there's a lot of meanings to it. The, the regular name of it is called The Con Consequences of War. However, <clears throat> the actual name of it is The Allegory of the Outbreak of War by Peter Paul Rubens. And this means a lot of things. As we can see, it looks really chaotic and stuff. Um, just basically some like a gist of things is in Roman ways of life and living, temple doors were always closed in times of peace. This one's open, so it shows that clearly something's not right. Um, in the middle is a soldier, but he's shedding blood with his sword, and he's stepping on and destroying documents. So like if a city, how during times of war, this is a consequence, you know, very important things and documents and whatever they may be on paper are destroyed. There's bloodshed, and unfortunately there's worse things. And it's supposed to represent um, Ares, the god of war, but more commonly known to the Romans as Mars. And so uh, it shows him having, like, I don't know, chaos over everything, and it's pretty bad. It's the consequences or the allegory of the outbreak of war by Peter Paul Rubens. Another fun fact is this was sold to actually um, a member of the Medici family back then. Is, the like, is it he really gives the cloth and all the effects a really nice ch texture and a 3D image? It really feels like these pictures are bouncing off the painting and the human body is really nice. This artist, this artist had a really good grasp of anatomy.